All right. We're here at Big Apple Con. I'm Tim Dowd, and we're here with Brian Shearer, artist, and he would like to talk to you a little about his project. Uh, well, um, I've done a couple. Uh, right, just finished up a Doctor Who miniseries called A Fairy Tale Life for IDW. I uh, inked uh, four issues and penciled and inked the last, um, well, issues three and four of the last two. Uh, I've also got a couple web comics going on. One is Deputy Witch, which is uh, about 60 pages in. And the other one is Vex, which is completed. And uh, right now it's still online to read, so you can go and read that. And we're looking for uh, uh, printing, so hopefully it'll uh, be in book form pretty now soon. Can you tell us a little bit about the uh, Doctor Who miniseries, the, the story of that? Yeah, uh, the Doctor Who um, miniseries is written by Matthew Sturges, who uh, wrote Jack of Fables and some Batman stuff, I believe. Um, the first two issues were penciled by Kelly Yates. Um, it's the story of um, uh, the Doctor and Amy uh, get on this planet, which uh, they, they find themselves in, in a uh, medieval kind of fairy tale situation. And it's only two only two issues are out, so I don't want to. I'm not going to ruin it for you. Okay. <laughs> but um, it's a good story. It, it, it really is. Uh, now jumping on to uh, Deputy Witch, sure. can you talk to us a little bit about what that project's about? Uh, it's the story of this girl who's been kind of sheltered her entire life. Uh, uh, her dad has moved her around from town to town, and um, everyone thinks she's a witch. She stops a, a um, burglary in progress and gets deputized, hence deputy witch. So uh, um, I would read that. I don't want to. I don't want to say more because I don't want to. <laughs> no. Okay. And what, what, can you, what can you tell me about Vex before right, we spoil Vex. the plot? <laughs> Vex is a story about a high school jock, arrogant jerk who uh, ticks off a gypsy lunch lady. And she curses his yearbook so that anything anybody writes in it comes literally true. Ah. So, for example, um, uh, they write, uh, uh, "Don't ever change." You know, that's a pretty common thing. He can't change out of his clothes. So, literally, stuff like that. Um, and they, they get progressively worse, so by the end of the story, he has to deal with serious curses. That's very unfortunate. But uh, all right, that, sound, I mean, that sounds like actually a really cool premise right there. Um, now, is there a website anywhere if someone could follow your work, particularly? Uh, Brian-Shearer.com. 